Hello and welcome back to Southeast Asia where the day is 26 February and it's the dawn. We have recently, as in the last episode, encountered an IJN uh, task force somewhere here. <clears throat> so we are going to look for it and task force A is going to en engage it and hopefully sink. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Uh, if it does slip through, Task Force Day is uh, patrolling here in front of uh, Surabaya because I'm pretty sure it's trying to get to Surabaya. Um, that's the situation with this Task Force, but let's go and review the strategic situation. Singapore has just about everything it needs, so it's in a happy place and we will start moving things there like the uh, supplies, engineering and fuel, so we can upgrade the air bases because that's our victory condition. Allen Bank has everything it needs. It doesn't have supplies, but it doesn't need it. It's Singapore that we will send the supplies to. Um, Trusty is going back to Batavia, which means that Batavia needs some fuel because without fuel, Trusty cannot rearm. Uh, it also needs some supplies because once Trusty rearms, uh, this is going to drop to 10, which is clearly not sufficient. Uh, what we will do is we will then ship some supplies from Surabaya to Batavia because Surabaya has quite a bit of it. Um, I want to keep the engineering and fuel here, uh, both because of the planes and also because sort of uh, rearming as we need to. Um, chill out, chap. See, I can pronounce it now. A uh, chill chap uh, has everything it needs, so again, um, we don't need to worry about it too much at the moment. Then Pasar uh, doesn't have supplies again, but again, we don't let, we have to worry about it. It has engineering, it has fuel, and I'm actually going to pick some of that and take it to Makassar, because integrity of the base there is dropping a lot, and I don't really want to use, lose this base level 3. So, very likely, Bantam here is going to pick up the supplies and head there, as well as Kama, and when she gets to Denpasar, she will pick some fuel. Um, Plandria here is on her way to Australia, it's going to take her ages, uh, and we will release her there. It's uh, four points, but it's uh, four points better than no points. Plan Cameron uh, is on the other hand, going the other way to Batavia, where she will start uh, delivering the engineering that we need there to build Singapore up. Um, one of our first destroyers that we bought, Electra, is heading here as well. She will join the task force day if need be. Um, but eventually she will actually join task force A and so we can start releasing some of the damaged Dutch destroyers so they can head to Australia and get repaired. And the same holds for this Task Force 26, where we bought four new destroyers. I think the Dutch destroyers are actually better, um, but, uh, well, except for depth charging, of course. But, uh, um, yeah, I really, really think that uh, they need to go home and get some repairs. Yeah, uh, they have more torpedoes, they have uh, float planes. The, the Dutch destroyers are pretty good, actually. Um, Anyway, that's it. I'm going to hunt for this uh, task force, and when I get it, I'll dial back. Oh, uh, actually, here is this thing here, uh, which I'm going to ignore because I actually think it's the sub chasers, so I'm not worried about it. If we run into it, we will sink it. If we don't, we won't, but I'm not worried about it now. So that's it, and I will talk to you when hopefully I will engage this. Uh, Merchant Task Force. Okay, we have discovered that uh, convoy, so uh, I am sending Task Force A towards it and we will engage. And here they are. Okay, let's identify these things. This looks like a bookie to me. Okay, Minakaze, Kamikaze, and it's not a Fubuki, it most likely is, so let's identify it as a cookie. Uh, we are going to split the... Uh,
three forces here. So, these guys will go here and stop shooting. Our British destroyers will take a detour and come on them from the second side. And how is it looking? Like this, I think that's good. And I in the sky go closer. I in the sky go closer and climb up. Big guys, I will shoot at the destroyers. The destroyers are bravely charging against us. Um, not that it's going to help them. You can see them right at the horizon, which means first they're just got hit. They're bracketing her, but uh, that's not enough. We're bracketing her, but we need to hit her, not just bracket her. Bracketing is not enough. Okay, we have hit something by the looks of it. One of the destroyers has turned, the other one is burning nicely. While our seagull doing some decent spotting. I don't know why these binoculars have inverted uh, controls. I never understood that. It doesn't make sense to me, but whatever. Okay, this bookie is burning nicely as well. are giving her a proper uh, warm uh, Abda welcome is what I would call it. The other Fubuki is looking fairly rough as well. Uh, when we drop the destroyers I will use the torpedoes to get close to the ships and sink them with torpedoes. Oh, torpedoes in the water. Car turn port. So this bookie is uh, looking extremely rough. Doesn't look like we've got any damage so far. I think the destruction current effects here is working very well. I wouldn't want to be you. Wouldn't want to be you, very windy, uh, never mind the AAA, but uh, doing your job. Like he's getting hammered at point blank. This one is dead in water. Uh, you know what, Houston? Uh, oh. And fire it here. run out of high explosives. Fine. And I just make sure you see it. He is not. And he is thinking as well. Here is the Wookiee Brave Buki trying to um, protect the merchants, not very successfully, but tried. Here is the other one you can see. How she tried to fight till the last moment. And open fire. I've decided that I'm going to fire with everyone. That was a magazine explosion right off the bat. Osaka Maru, Osaka Maru, Kamoi Maru, Kamoi Maru, Kamoi Maru, Kamoi Maru, Kamoi Maru, okay. Um, you can start firing as well, to be honest. This is sinking as we expected after a magazine explosion, which was extremely quick. It's a little surprise. Um, yeah, this one is going to go down very quickly as well. It's a point blank. It's. Uh, Fish meat barrel. These are our forces. 
that's the long, ah, uh, that's upper. I guess you have a quote there. And this is what we are putting at. And it looks like she's dead in a walker. And probably just suffered magazine explosion, by the looks of it. Yes, two. And it's going down. Yomoi Maru's magazine explosion. Another, uh, yeah. Fish meat barrel. So, our last target. And uh, uh, the only one we will get uh, one point for. Left and right, we are some shooting. Uh, well, I'm going to slow down. We don't want to overrun. So, we slow down to slightly faster than she is. And we will see whether the destroyer can sink with a sub count. It's interesting because uh, these dis Dutch destroyers have the main guns are 120 4.7 inch guns. Uh, the gun on the on trussy is 4 inch gun. Yet when you see the guns from the destroyer seem to do way more damage than the guns from Trusty did on the same field. We are going to send the fish her way. And a fish is off. And here it comes. Little tin fish. And I should put pay to her. Almost certainly. Might I just well send the second one? A second torpedo launcher and the second ten fish is in the water. Nice and clear water, we will be able to see it as it comes and uh, does it sink. Here it comes. And it was a dud. How about then uh, one of our light cruisers actually? Okay, one of our launchers is preparing and the fish is away. You can see just here. Well, it's cool how you see the um, fires and hear the explosions underwater, but it's not so cool when you see the smoke underwater. Uh, that's, uh, it looks a bit weird. Here is the fish. And another dad. No, we we will stop and Hobart will give her a solo. From the main guns. That's torpedoes, that's uh, yeah, anyways. Oh, here, and we have sunk 32,000 tons and got a whopping one command point there for them. Nice, Electra actually will go and join Task Force A while Task Force Day will go back to its own usual hunting grounds. Actually, no. Task Force Day, we, we seem to get the merchants here. Uh, this looks like a ripe hunting grounds for merchants, so we will hunt here with Task Force Day. Uh, Task Force A will go, will head towards uh, Surabaya as will Electra. 
there, Electra will replace the heavily damaged uh, uh, leading uh, uh, Dutch destroyer Vanguard that will head back for Darwin to be released, and uh, uh, we will wait for this task force uh, as well, and then we will get some supplies to Batavia. That's the current plan, and uh, I will dial in when I have some more news. Well, we run into some Mavises uh, that decided to torpedo bomb this uh, nice uh, Javanese mountain. But our purchases are most likely going to make short work of them, I hope. Shot 3 already. Uh, that's, that's number six, so that's going to be down shortly. Pretty sure this one doesn't look very good either. We have to watch so that we don't run into a. Uh, yeah, number six down. And this one down, and we've downed all of them. Lost six, nice. That's the way to do it. It's the dawn of February 27th, and I'm going to finish the episode here. Um, the only thing that happened overnight was Cimarron has uh, stopped at Batavia and dropped fuel there, and Task Force Ace as well, allowing Trusty to refuel, and she's now heading back uh, east of uh, Singapore to patrol in her hunting grounds. Um, and that's pretty much it. Uh, the rest of it will wait, the big recap and everything will wait for till the next episode. I hope you enjoyed this one, even though it probably wasn't as dramatic as the previous one with Rusty. Uh, if you did enjoy it, uh, please consider subscribing, commenting or liking. Uh, any and all of that helps the channel quite a bit. Uh, so I will see you next time. Bye!